Welcome to This Week in Gato, where we take a look at the interesting, the awesome, and the weird things being developed this week in the Gato engine. And for 2023, we're taking the favorite project for each week and entering it into a tournament for the best Gato project of the year. So be sure to comment which number project was your favorite this week. Number eight. A dangerous, sentient slime heads toward the nearby town, and it's up to you to stop it in its tracks. Xenospore places you in charge of controlling an alien threat intent on destroying everything in its path. This indie puzzler requires you to strategize how and where you clean up the infestation. After each move, the Xenospore grows, so you must choose your actions carefully. Destroy tiles to stave off infection and cleanse tiles before they overcome to the alien spread. You can play Xenospore for free on itch.io. Number 7. Guns N' Rush is an engaging sci-fi game that combines roguelike, bullet hell, and RPG elements. Create a unique character and collect loot to battle increasingly difficult levels filled with monsters. With a wide variety of weapons and bonuses, you can use your creativity to fight back the alien horde as you see fit. With randomly generated maps and smart progression system, you'll be looking for new ways to advance to the next wave. This week's video is sponsored by Gato Sky, a brand new sky system that allows you to easily create dynamic skies within Gato 4.0. For more information, check out the link in the description. And if you would like to sponsor a weekly video, you can contact us on our website, stayathomedev.com. Number six. At number six is a Metroidvania title set in a fantasy world where your only means of survival is your own ability to solve problems. After receiving a distress call from a mysterious creature, Iria sets off on an adventure to look for answers, only to find that she is wanted by the Prophet in a militarized government that sees her as a sinner. What jumped out in particular were the interesting rotational level designs and art style. You can learn more on their website in the description. Number five. Stranded God was sent in by a viewer of the channel and places you on a goblin-controlled island, completely forgotten by your kin. Alone with no real hope of survival, you stumble upon an odd-looking scarecrow who is the embodiment of a human god, and they need your help. Work together to defend each other against the goblin horde. Construct different buildings to expand your town and recruit more humans to withstand the nightly attacks from the goblins. You can play Stranded God for free right now on itch.io. Number four. Not much is known about our number four spot, the Ancient Sun. Sitting on Geopard 5902's YouTube channel is a series of dev videos showcasing locations and elements of the game. And while there isn't a lot of solid information about the game, what is there looks very polished. We'll have to keep an eye on this one for the future, and you can too by checking out their YouTube channel. Number three. Number three is a bit different from the other entries in that there is no game, but rather a cool procedural art technique to recreate the video from Bad Apple. Using a multi-mesh and shaders, the original video is played in the viewport which is passed as a texture to a custom shader. The multi-mesh spawns cubes, which are adjusted for depth based on the output of the video. It's a very interesting effect despite its simplicity and execution. Number two. Strategy games are difficult. The gameplay has to be well balanced while also being easy to jump into and challenging enough to keep players interested. Lure is a minimalist and cozy city builder game about bringing light back into the world. Build structures, interact with the world tiles in small mini games. Explore the darkness to expand your city and make tough choices as you try to bring the light back. And before we get to our number one spot, Congrats to last week's winner who won in a tight vote, Katana Dragon, earning a place in our 2023 Gato Project of the Year tournament. Be sure to comment which number project was your favorite this week. Number one. Defend against waves of alien attackers in this roguelike survival miner game. Dig for resources and choose from powerful upgrade paths, but manage your time wisely. Will you have enough time to go a little deeper in the mine? Or should you go back and defend your dome from oncoming alien attackers? Balance your defenses against air and ground attacks and take control when needed to defeat the alien scum. You can buy Domekeeper right now on Steam. 